emotional comeback. An El Dorado County soldier who lost his legs fighting in Afghanistan is now on a mission to recover. Yeah, he's getting some help from celebrities, and as you can see in this picture here, even from President Obama. The 19th Damani Lewis talked to his dad in Placerville. He gave me the biggest hug. Charles Harris remembers the day he saw his injured son, Army Private First Class Douglas Harris, bandaged and in a hospital bed, not knowing what his future held. Because two months ago, we didn't know if we were going to keep him. We didn't know if he was still going to be alive. While patrolling in Afghanistan, Douglas walked on an IED. He lost both of his legs. Since the explosion, Charles says his son's humor and will went into ultra drive. The anger that I thought would come out of him, uh, no. It's, uh, he, he's, he's very upbeat and positive. At one point in time, he said, you know, I, I don't think it'd be a bad idea to come back here and help other soldiers. I joined at a time of war knowing this can happen now. Now he's no reason to be naked in the battle now since I'm you know, just sitting here just feeling sorry for myself. And there are celebrities helping to encourage Harris, from wrestling superstar John Cena, Gene Simmons and Kiss, and even the commander-in-chief. Harris says he's pushing himself in physical therapy and is already standing on one prosthetic leg. His goal, a simple one. I'm looking forward to November when I can uh, get back to Fort Lewis to see my guys come home and then uh, come back to uh, California to uh, you know, see everyone back home. In Placerville, Damani Lewis, KCRA 3, 19. What an amazing attitude. Well, Harris says he doesn't regret anything and he says he would do it all over again. He's expected to spend the next 6 to 12 months and Walter Reed recovering from his injuries. He says he hopes to continue serving his country once his injuries have healed.